Hello German, my name is PGP, welcome to the channel, and today we're going to be talking about Funstock, and why I love the new, uh, the game store Funstock. Now a lot of people were like, is this a bland deal, are you getting paid to talk about Funstock? No, I'm not getting paid, I'm just going to say, uh, from the interactions I've the company and the orders I've placed for the company, uh, I, f I find it a great service. Now first of all, let's talk about these five games here, right? I ordered all of these games on the... Uh, at the time of recording this video, it's a Thursday, so it was about on last Saturday. So I ordered them on the Saturday. I ordered the Atari Lynx collections on their own, uh, about half two, and I ordered the other three: Pico Two, Worms, and uh, Xenocrisis Tanglewood. About four hours later, they both arrived on the same day after I ordered them, and they arrived obviously exclude Sunday. They arrived on the Wednesday, which was three days later. So that's quite fast service. I didn't get charged extra for the shipping. You know, because I didn't, I didn't think I was desperately needed because obviously I have the I had the other cartridges, I had the other thirteen cartridges, and I was on holiday at the time, so I didn't really want it to be next day shipping and be like, oh, they arrive and I'm no one's home to claim them. So there's that, and like like, like the Evercade as a whole, like the whole Evercade community as a whole, and the whole um, Evercade social media page. It feels as if the fun stock page. They actually seem to care about what they're doing. They actually like the positivity. They, they want to promote positivity in just gaming. Because I've heard interaction with them. They're like, oh, that's such a great uh, game thing. Like, I I think I questioned them once on Twitter about if they had any uh, Evercade VS uh, premium premium edition orders still available. And they said no. So I could get a starter pack. So I've got a starter pack, an extra controller, and the Galico arcade collection from Funstock. Was on holiday. Obviously, I paid up front so I could get the console in uh, November. Although, considering they sent out the games a bit early for the Mega Cat and Code Masters collections recently, I assume I'm going to get the console a few days early. Which, if so, great. If not, I don't mind waiting till the third of November or not. And basically, I told uh, the Twitter user Sir Top and Hat about what I was doing. That I had just dropped seventy-five pounds for these five collections. And I had, I had previously told him earlier on in the day I was going to wait on Xenocrest Tangled, Pico 2, and Worms. But I decided to just get them all together, you know, get them all together on, you know, £45. That's nothing. Well, it might be, it's a lot of money, it's a bit of money for quite a few people. But to me at the time, I had the money, I still have quite a bit of money, so I'm, I can buy Mocat and Mocat 2 and, uh, what the Codemasters collections, but I'm going to wait on those collections a little bit. I just bought these five. I bought the VS. I bought an extra arcade collection. So I've bought a lot of stuff. So I'm going to give myself a bit of a break before binge buying again. And to be honest, I'm still waiting to decide which one I want first, Megcat 2 or Codemasters, because normally I order one cartridge at a time. In this case, I ordered, I ordered two and then three. So that was just because, you know, it was... I was bored and I had the money, so I thought, you know, I'd buy, finish my Evercade collection for now. And yeah. And with Funstock, you know, they're really helpful, really good service. You know, I haven't had any problems with them so far. And like, people are like, oh yeah, you only place two orders. Well, yeah, but to be fair, I was always I was quite skeptical about the company to begin with because they're a small company compared to, you know, like Amazon. And, you know, when you've got Amazon, you've got, um, you know, game sells them in the UK, which is our biggest game uh, game store chain. But most of those games are now you have to buy them off the website. You can't go to the store and buy them. You know, you've got the store main kind, which is like a pop culture sort of store, which the one in my one of my cities shut down recently. And we have Argos, which Argos normally doesn't have most of the games in stock, or doesn't sell certain games. Like all five of these, not a single one was sold at Argos at my local Argos. So. I just thought, you know, buy them all from Funstock, you know, get a deal. Well, I didn't get a deal, but, you know, I thought, you know, get them all. Hopefully they come around the same time. They all came on the same day, three days after, or four days after they've been ordered, but obviously we've got to exclude the Sunday, so it was three days. And, yeah, basically, I want to say to anyone listening, you know, if a game's on Funstock and it's a game that you want to buy, whether it be for the PS4, PS Vita, Switch, or a retro console or the Evercade, Especially the Evercade, uh, order it from Funstock. You know, support support the small small store because it's a really good service. You know, it's really quick. And you know, 
they act, like if you tweet at them on Twitter, they'll respond to you. You can have a conversation with the staff and the users. It's great. And I personally recommend it. And I recommend everyone watching this video to use Funstock uh, for any future gaming purchases, especially when it comes down to the Evercade. And if you guys still need to pre-order the uh, Evercade VS, I'm, I recommend doing it through Funstock as well. Uh, so you, you, so you've at least booked an order. And I know Funstock also has a, had a, had a, has had exclusive Evercade VS, an Evercade VS Founders Edition, and a Black Evercade handheld in the past, which are now sold out. So if you use Funstock, you might be able to get one of those deals in the future. But yeah, that's just my thoughts. Uh, thank you all for listening and watching. And let me know, let me know your thoughts. Do you use Funstock? Do you use Amazon? Do you use Game? Do you use GameStop? What do you use to get your Evercade games? Uh, do you recommend it? Uh, I obviously recommend Funstock. And yeah. Catch you on the next video. Peace.